What is down, everybody? It is your main course, little pancake, and we are back with another tier list video. Huh? What was that? You can't see? Oh. That's probably because I'm wearing camouflage. You couldn't see me. Yeah. I mean, I'm looking pretty good in this beautiful sweatshirt that my cousin got me. It's a fashion statement. It's a fashion statement. Fashion statement is. Don't wear this. But aside from that, we are doing Star Wars character tier list. But with a little spin, my special touch, would I trust these people with my children? Now, there might be some confusion. I don't have children that I know of. But we are just going through all the Star Wars characters that are on this list. There is a lot, so there's going to be at least two parts. Should get interesting. Should be good. So, let's hop right into it. Your one and only Yoda. Now, we all know Yoda is supposedly the wisest Jedi, right? The wisest person in all of Star Wars. So, I would definitely think he would do well watching my children, right? Now, it depends. I mean, you got you got prequels Yoda, and you got originals Yoda. Prequels Yoda is definitely probably a better candidate. <laughs> But I think they're both S tier, in all honesty. We're going to throw it S tier for sure. I think Yoda would definitely take care of my kids. And there's no question as to whether or not he's going to protect them. He's a mad Jedi, right? He's got mad skills and all. As long as he's not dead, we're going to play it as if nobody's dead yet. Okay? Okay. So Yoda is an S tier for sure. Next up is your main man, Darth Vader. Now, Vader is supposedly a bad guy. I don't know, man. Because I feel like Vader wasn't a, the best, like, villain in Star Wars. Of course, Emperor Palpatine is the overarching villain, and that's kind of the story behind it. But Vader, I feel like, wasn't that good and all. You know what I mean? Because I feel like he does have a heart still. Like, I feel like Anakin Skywalker is still inside of that suit, you know? It's not just a straight-up robot that all it does is kill, kill, kill. We're going to throw Darth Vader B tier, I think, because he does have a temper. That's for sure, right? And we got to keep in mind that they're my children, so they're definitely going to push his button. So you got to keep that in mind, that he might just snap and be like, and then your kid's dead. And that's not exactly cool. All right, now we have good old Annie, Anakin Skywalker, before he was Darth Vader, right? This is the, like, kind of cool Anakin, right? I'm going to throw the probably same thing as a Darth Vader because it's it's really the same person. Their, like, physical appearance and their, like, some stuff might change, but it's still the same person. And they still have the same attitude and temper. So, I'll throw him B tier as well. Next up, we have Lando. I'd probably put Lando in A tier, honestly. I feel like he probably would do a decent job. I feel like he's genuinely a good guy. I think, like, he didn't have a choice, really. Uh... So, I'll throw him A tier. Not quite S tier, I don't think, but A tier, solid A tier. And now we have the man, the myth, the legend, Luke Skywalker. In my opinion, most overrated Jedi. Don't hate on me, but I'm just saying. I'll throw him A tier. I don't think he would do a great job watching children because I just don't trust him with children that much. I mean, A tier, there's not really much to say. He would do alright, I think, but I don't think he would do a great job. I don't think he would make them cookies for sure. Alright, I have no idea who this is. Judging by this small little one inch by one inch picture on the tier list, I can't tell who it is. It's probably someone I should know, but she looks genuine. She's got a little smirk. But she looks alright. She looks like a decent person. I'll throw her B tier, probably. I don't know her. You know, it's hard to judge someone that you're not sure who it even is. And next up is this person, who, again, not sure who it is. I didn't keep up with that much, like, animated Star Wars stuff. I was just never able to really like get full hardcore into it so i'm not sure who some of these people are but she definitely looks interesting she's got wings i don't know if that's like a butterfly behind her or if that's actual like wings coming out of her head and she can fly wouldn't neither would surprise me if she does have wings though and she can fly that's a that's a boost right because she can take my kids flying that'd be pretty epic you know as long as they don't fall to their death which is a likely possibility but I'll throw them C tier. I feel like she probably would try her best. But she seems kind of like a wild card. You know what I'm saying? She seems like she kind of just does her own thing. 
screw everybody else. Yeah, I'm big, I'm bad. Woo! And it's kind of like... But you have kids to take care of. Next up, we have C-3PO. I really like C-3PO, right? Well, he was like a big time character in the prequels, which is interesting because he wasn't as big of a character in the originals. It just, he seemed like he had completely different roles in the two, which I guess is a flaw of the prequels. He wasn't completely different. Like, there were still, I mean, he was the same dude. He was the same character, but it just seemed like a little odd. But C-3PO, definitely a trustworthy character, I would say. I'm going to put him in A tier. I don't think he's quite S tier because I feel like he wouldn't be very fun. You know, my kids might be able to have fun with him because they would just mess with him and asking him questions. Be like, A C three PO, which four hundred and thirty seven times two hundred and sixty two divided by eighty six point three pi. And he'd be like, Oh, my my calculations are correct. I think that it's a little bit, a little bit, but if you want that in English, you're gonna have to pay me fifteen cent. My brain just. Next up, we have Jar Jar Binks. Nothing against your Jar Jar, but F tier for sure. Jar Jar Binks would not uh, do well, I would say. He's going to try his best, sure. But uh, that's not going to be good enough. And he's probably going to end up dead with the children. Pretty much, if Jar Jar doesn't have someone to protect him, he's going to end up dying. And this dude, I don't know who he is. He looks familiar. He looks so familiar, but I can't, like... I can't pinpoint who he is. Doesn't look that trustworthy, if I'm being honest. He looks like he could be a little flick, you know? A little flick, you know? You know? That's English. I'm speaking English. That's Jar Jar. Misa gonna put him in a C tier. I don't trust him. I don't trust him. Watch yourself, buddy. Next up is Ventress. I do know who this is. She is not the most trustworthy, right? She's basically evil. Okay? Still think she would do better than Jar Jar. We're gonna throw her D tier. I'm sorry, Jar Jar, but my man. <laughs> Next up, we have Chewbacca. <laughs> How was that? Does that sound exactly like him? Hold on, let me try again. <laughs> Put in a Chewbacca sound effect right there. Future me. No. <laughs> Thanks. Chewbacca is. Definitely trustworthy. He's definitely going to take care of my kids. S tier with Yoda. Your kids would not want to leave. That that would be the only problem. They wouldn't want to leave. I mean, Chewbacca, definitely going to make cookies. Try to make cookies, at least. And he's going to let the kids help, because he doesn't know how to make cookies, probably. He's going to be like, You know? If you speak Wookiee, you definitely understood what I said. If not, mm, Google Translate. Okay, again, not sure who this is. I'm guessing is part of a spinoff movie. I don't know. But she looks genuinely nice. She looks kind of like that mother character, you know? Kind of like she would take care of you and be awesome. I don't know for sure, but we're going to go with it and put her A tier. I'm putting my trust in this woman. Could backfire. Probably will. Anytime I've ever put trust in women before... <laughs> Right back at me. But, <laughs> next up is Bost. This guy is a G. He was in Lego Star Wars, at least. That's the only reason I know him is because he was a character in Lego Star Wars, and he was insane, right? He's kind of like a bounty hunter. I, th I think he'd be genuinely nice. I think he would be kind to my children. You know, he, he's kind of scary. He'd probably kind of scare my kids. This isn't necessarily a bad thing, but I think I'm going to throw him B tier. For sure. I definitely wouldn't just say, like, yeah, here's my kids. Now, I would maybe, like, set up a meeting with him and talk to him for a little bit. And then if I got the right vibe, you know, oh, yeah, here, you can have him for a couple hours while I go eat dinner with my beautiful wife that is imaginary and a figment of my imagination. Okay, next up we have this person. I, I remember seeing her or him. I don't know if it's her or him. But I can't think of the name and I can't find a picture of them online so it's not as fuzzy but that's them you could probably get the gist of it probably go for a d tier with ventress i just don't think you do a very good job i feel like once again she's going to scare the kids all right kids are going to come home they're going to be like ah! they're not going to sleep for a week and that's not good 
So, we're going to throw a D tier. Not quite Jar Jar level, though. Alright, next up we have Cad Bane. He's part of, like, Jabba the Hutt's clan and all of that stuff mixed together. He's, I think, a bounty hunter. So, if you're affiliated with your boy Jabba, probably not the greatest person. Mm. I'll throw a C tier. Because if he does watch after the kids, the kids are safe. Right, but if he doesn't, then your kids are dead. So, it's a toss-up, really. 50-50 chance. I'd, I'd risk it. I'd risk it. Okay, I don't know who this is. Looks very nervous. Looks like he's about to get killed. So, that's not a good thing. Right? If you're about to get killed, then, you know, you're probably not the best defender. But looks looks like, uh, you know, someone who's worried about dying has to have a soul, right? I mean, if he wasn't worried about dying, then that's not good. But he's worried. So that's a, that's a plus, you know? That's good. I'm going to throw him B tier. I feel, like he's a, I feel like he would care for the children. But if, the, if it came down to it, I don't think he would uh, stick up for the children. Okay, next up is this guy. The orange one. I don't remember his name. I'm sorry. I don't know. Okay. But you know who it is. He's a pretty good guy. I mean, I wouldn't put him Rex level, but I would say him and Rex are pretty close. Right. I would say probably an A tier. Right. I, er, you know, let's go with B tier. Because he was influenced by Palpatine to, like, execute. Because that's what he's doing in this picture on the tier list. Is execute Order 66. All right. Gotcha. That's B tier. Because not, not very trustworthy, actually, now that I think about it. Okay, the final character for today, Count Dooku, right? He got his head chopped off, but we're, we're gonna, we're gonna move on from that. Dooku's a pretty bad dude, All right? In many ways, he's, he's not a good person, overall, and he's very good at Jedi. So, you know, it's another one that's kind of like, he could kill your kids, you know, he could just say, like, oh, I had enough of you, ka -ching. Or, he could protect your children. And if, he's, if he decides to protect your children, then you're good, right? You're set. So I think we're going to throw it with another C tier. Also, I forgot to mention about Anakin. The whole, you know, him killing the younglings. I'm not too worried about that. I'm pretty sure my kids are smarter than those little dumb Jedis, okay? Because they were like, Anakin just walks in, shing! He's like, what are you doing? Master Anakin, what should we do? My kids be like, they see the lights every day, but like, oh, shoot! And they dip, right? They're out there, you know? And it's like, oh, that didn't work as planned. I mean, I, I, I'm smart, right? No! I'm gonna have smart kids, right? No! So that's how that's gonna play out. So, tell you people that are like, uh, actually, I'm gonna kill a lot of little kids, so he'd probably do it again. My kids ain't gonna get killed by Anakin, because they're smart. I ain't gonna get tricked by some dude. So, that's gonna do it for today's part one of this tier list. We're going to have a part two tomorrow. Might need a part three, in all honesty. There's a lot on this list. We might need a part three, or tomorrow's video will just be a little long. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you would change about this tier list in the comments below. Would you trust Jar Jar? Let me know. Tell me. And make sure to like the video if you liked it. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. And watch that video over there. Subscribe over here. You know, just do it, please. Please, please do it. And I'll see y'all later. Have a great day.